Rise and shine! On behalf of all hunting parties, let me welcome you to the Jamboree! The Jamboree is Alice in Wonderland meets Lost meets uh, Saw. Basically, it's um, a killing game uh, in the woods, uh, sort of like a survival game. And uh, let's just say that there's a lot of killing, a lot of blood. Mayhem is just one of the reasons that attracted Kelly Veltry to this type of horror movie. The horror genre is just a really easy genre to make. Comedies can be hit or miss. Drama's the same thing. You know, normally with uh, dramas, you need sort of like that big star or like that we, big name or somebody uh, to really steal uh, the show. But with horror, you know, you can get away with, um, you know, a lower name actor or somebody like that. Um, you know, as long as you have the story there, it's going to be a good movie. The rules are, as always, kill or be killed. Ten kills and this all disappears. Some kind of game? <laughs> Thrill to kill? <laughs> to keep you honest and me entertained, a person very close to your heart is being held against their will. If you ever want to see their happy little faces again, then it's time to harness that inner demon. The Jamboree is a thriller horror that was shot up Kelowna Mountain where the 2003 fire swept through. The scenery of burnt trees enables Veltry to get that eerie look for his twisted bloodbath. The concept for the movie was developed by Jeff Bunting and Veltry produced the screenplay. I want to know what's going on. Who are you? My apologies, how rude of us. To introduce ourselves. Veltri is a fan of Darren Aronofsky and Quentin Tarantino. He's now produced five short films and been involved in about 30 movies in total. Veltri originally came to Kelowna to go to the Center for Arts and Technology, where he now works as an instructor. The Jamboree was originally shown at Horror Fest. The Horror Fest version was basically just um, what we had thrown together just to get it done for Horror Fest. Ever since then, it's been, what, about two months later, I've been editing and, uh, you know, uh, working on the audio, working on the color correction, uh, tightening up some of the scenes and trying to make it a perfect cut for a uh, festival run. The last two movies Veltri made, The Howl and Dig, were also shown at Horror Fest, a great venue for short films. Initially, the Jamboree wasn't supposed to be 45 minutes in length. Basically, it just got out of control. It started out as a 10 minute movie and it just grew and grew and grew. And it sort of is uh, what it is now. It, it never meant to be a 45 minute movie. A lot of the audio is actually totally uh, redone. Um, we went into um, uh, Music City Studios and we uh, redid uh, the actors' voices. It's called uh, ADR and put in our own uh, sound effects and um, a background. It was made in conjunction with the Okanagan Society of uh, Independent Filmmaking. They provided some money to help us out as well as uh, some of the gear. OSIF's a great way for, you know, for any uh, new uh, filmmaker to really get into it and to really you know, learn uh, the craft of filmmaking. The movie is now 90% finished and the premiere will be shown at the Paramount Theatre later this month. And action. Beyond Kelowna, we're going to try to put it into as many film festivals as we can. There is plenty of uh, horror uh, um, uh, film festivals all over the world. All that we're sort of hoping with this is a little bit of recognition for uh, what we've done and hopefully it can lead to more movies being filmed here. No! Veltri is also developing a pilot for an extreme sports show. He's found the movie making business to be a competitive industry that requires certain types of attributes to survive and succeed. Anybody in their garage with a couple thousand dollars can be a filmmaker, yes. I think what separates filmmakers from film enthusiasts is passion and uh, drive and uh, persistence. Um, you know, it's not easy. You have to realize that it's going to be tough and that you might not get paid for a while. It's sort of a feast or famine type of industry. If you like horror movies, and remember this is mature content, you'll like this flick. To find out the premiere date and time, search Jamboree Movie on Facebook. Visit 1984productions.com for more on Kelly Veltry.